it's Taylor and we are live in London. Today I have two very exciting guests. I have the all-round Ginger Ninja and comedian Keith Lemon. Ninja. And... I'm a ninja. Yeah, you are, officially. <laughs> and the most amazing, gorgeous actress, singer and presenter, Ashley Roberts. Now, now, shake, 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 shake. This, this is the I'm original. like sniffing the tin, like, yeah, like, like yeah, it's yeah. not over it's here. I'm in La Condesa, one of my favourite places to hang out in Mexico City. It's full of bars and cafes, and now it's home to the best breakfast in town, las tortas de chilequiles. ¿Y por qué son tan buenas de tuyos, no? ¿Por qué son buenas? Porque... Sí, ¿por qué son tan buenas? Son las mejores en el mundo, me han dicho. No, no. <laughs> Welcome to Stand Out Ballet Backstage Live. I'm Pips Taylor, and we're down at the brewery in central London for the Fragrance Foundation Awards 2018. Still get to party a little bit? Yeah, a little bit, yeah, if we want to. Ross, did they go to bed does. early? No, you know what? They're, 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 <laughs> quite, they're quite tame, um, but uh, they have their moments. But, Martin, um, are you going to take that quite tame? What? <laughs> This is such an amazing class. Yeah, I feel really good. Come at me, I'm ready for you. you know, you've maybe kind of like had a bit too much to drink on a school night and you've got to go to work at 7am. How do you get yourself through an epic hangover? And there's, there's always such a real depth to your music as well, especially with, within the songwriting. And obviously you've had, you know, with 25 years, there's such highs and lows of, of life that yeah. obviously influence records and, you know, where you are, the stage of your life. What's been something that's kind of happened recently that's really kind of driven your creative process mm. with, the, with the writing? Um, I think just being a parent, really. Mexico City has a reputation for being one of the most dangerous cities in the world, and it's often singled out for its violent crime but it's just been listed as the number one travel destination in the world by the New York Times. So how safe really is Mexico City? I, mean, like, yeah. I, I really enjoy the creative side yeah, yeah. and I basically take a recipe and sort of like, you know, take it as guidance. Whereas like my other half yeah, will follow off it piece. as a, I'm off piece and yeah. he's I'm always off menu, off piece yeah. and he's Even when like, you're ordering in a Bible. restaurant, you yeah. are like literally, she's never on piece for food. <laughs> it's only Nile Rodgers and Johnny Marr, woohoo! So I've got a few tips for you on things to try, which are like local all right, delicacies. All right, all right, yeah. So in Glasgow, they're quite famous for the fried Mars bar. Has anyone had any one of those? Has anyone tried those? Yeah, so, yeah, they're good, aren't they? Literally a fried Mars bar. I'm here to find out what is a real hipster in Los Angeles and what do they even do all day? Can we actually just touch upon this? Why do you make such a good girl? I think it's I've got his nice eyes. eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Facial hair really adds as well. Yeah, that throws it a little bit, <laughs> doesn't it? We are officially trending in New York City. Nice. This is huge. And we have got so much good stuff coming up on Build. And don't forget, you can download for pre order uh, Feeder's new album, Tallulah, which will be out in August. Yeah, we hope you've enjoyed the show. Please do tune in for more. And if you didn't like it, don't come back. <laughs> See you next time. Bye, guys.